HMS Hermes was the first designed aircraft carrier in the world, but due to delays in the time of construction, she was commissioned after the Japanese carrier Hosho. It's based on the cruiser type hull and was originally designed to carry both wheeled aircraft and seaplanes. Two islands were added on the full length of the flight deck. One hangar was placed on the hull and each island contained a funnel. Two elevators were placed on the deck. She could carry around 20 aircraft. Hermes was ordered in April 1917 and was laid down on January 15, 1918. The ship was launched on September 11, 1919 and was commissioned in on February 18, 1924. Standard displacement was just over 11,000 tons. Length was at 182.9 meters, beam at 29.4 meters, and draft at 7.1 meters at deep load. Six water tube boilers generated 40,000 shaft horsepower. Two geared steam turbines connected to two shafts gave her the speed of 25 knots. On trials, she produced 41,000 shaft horsepower and she had the speed of just over 26 knots. Armament consisted of six single 5.5-inch guns and three single 4-inch anti-aircraft guns. Belt armor was at 3 inches and deck at 1 inch. Her construction was slowed down as most of her resources were sent off to the conversion of HMS Eagle. In the 1920s, after commissioning of the ship, she was assigned to the Atlantic Fleet where she would conduct flying trials with the Ferry 3D reconnaissance aircraft. Then she conducted exercises in the Mediterranean in early 1925. Then in June, Hermes sailed to the China Station and arrived at Hong Kong on August 10, 1925. Her aircraft attacked a pirate base on the Chinese coast. In the 1930s, she would shuttle back and forth for refits and would take part in rescuing the survivors of the submarine Poseidon. She would sail to the Yangtze River to help with floods near the city of Han Chao. Later in the decade, her aircraft would force pirates on the captured ship to abandon it. She was later classified as a training ship in 1938, but was classified as an aircraft carrier in August 1939. During World War II, she was assigned to attack U-boats. Then, alongside the battleship Strasbourg, she hunted German blockade runners and raiders in the South Atlantic. Then, on the night of July 7th, Hermes attempted to drop four depth charges under the French battleship Richelieu Stern with the support of a torpedo bomber attack from Swordfish aircraft. The torpedo attack proved to be more successful. While returning, Hermes rammed HMS Corfu on July 10th during bad weather. Repairs began on August 5th at Simonstown in South Africa. The repairs took 12 days. Then Hermes was joined by the light cruiser Dragon to search German commerce raiders in the South Atlantic. Hermes was assigned to the Eastern Fleet on February 14th. Five days later, she was put to sea to receive aircraft of the 418th Squadron and joined the destroyer HMAS Vampire to conduct anti-submarine patrols. After the raid on Colombo by the Kiro Butai on April 5th, Hermes and Vampire were sent to Tricomalee to prepare for Operation Ironclad, the British invasion of Madagascar. They were spotted off Batikaloa by a recon aircraft from the battleship Harana. 85 D-38 dive bombers and 9 A6M Zeros were launched to attack these two ships. At least 32 attacked them and both sunk with multiple bombs landing on both ships. Only 4 D-38 dive bombers were lost in the attack and two Fulmars were shot down.